Hello everybody, it's the Tasty Crazy Food Review Show. And I'm here by myself again today. Ashley's out, probably doing something else. I tried to call him, he wouldn't answer the phone. I might have to have a talk with that young man, see what the hell's going on here. But anyway, today we got a food review. And we got this stuff to drink. We're staying away from the soda. My New Year's resolution is going to be to, um, or will be, to cut back on uh, Pepsi made with real sugar. We're getting this stuff uh, called Crystal Light in these uh, little containers here. They come in all different colors and flavors and everything like that. And let's see if we can get it into the the uh, bottom. Crazy Tasty Food Review Show. Let me adjust something on the camera here. Being by myself, a one-man operation requires a man. We got the damn thing turned on. Yes, we do. It's saying REC, which is a preposition for on, something like that. Okay, so you pour that in there, and you put the lid back in, and you shake it like that, baby. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. My name's Larry. Josh isn't here today. Okay, and um, what are we going to do first? I think I'll show you the food we got. We got more steak and shake. And uh, we have the steak and shake beef taco salad. Since the, uh, the other one was such a big hit on our show and 25 other shows, I thought I'd give a little bit of comparison to the uh, Wendy's taco salad. And here is some dressing. Hello, Mark. How y'all doing out there today? Today's a great day. It's been raining all day. I don't know when you'll see this, but Christmas is a couple days away. We'll probably be waiting next year before this show will be shown, but who cares? Okay, we have steak and shake today. How you doing there, Piggy? Yeah, you can see you're there with Hippie Harry again. Anything going on? Well, Larry, we're thinking about tying a knot. Tying a knot? What the hell does tying a knot mean? You know, getting it together. Now that they've had that operation or anything from last summer, things are going pretty good. Okay, it's enough of that. Poor hippie Harry. If I were you, I'd head for the hills. And they give you this uh, kind of space top here. Spaceship top. And here is taco. It's got a bunch of red stuff in it. Uh, steak shaped hamburger meat it's supposed to be. Um, I don't know about that. Let me just take a little taste. Mm, it is a steak and shake meat. It's got the, um, I forgot what you call these red things, tortillas or whatever. Don't get me started on that again. Lettuce, a few kinds of um, cheeses. I see a white and a cheddar cheese in there. And it even has some romaine lettuce in there. Whoa, getting up in the world here. And we got some ranch dressing. All you people that like ranch dressing. I'm going to try in a few minutes to do a joke that a, a viewer, she's more than a viewer, she's our den mother. Den mother? And um, Kelly's been with us the long haul. You're thick and thin. We'll lose everybody. Then everybody wanders back. We are all kind of new people. Uh, I'm putting a little ranch dressing on here. Make things a little bit appetizing, I guess. Um, got a lot of new viewers in the last month or so. I don't know if they know about Alfred. Alfred is our mascot here on the show. And uh, he's been with us about a year now. Keeps an eye on everything while we're gone. 
And um, whatever. So let me put this here. And um, let's take a uh, the everything count of fork here and take a first test of uh, this uh, salad. Boy, well, yeah, it has got a lot of cheese on it, let me tell you. It's about the same size and weight that the uh, Wendy's was. I think the Wendy's was six bucks. This was four bucks. So we get a little bit more of a deal here, I guess. Um. Mm. Mm. Right off the bat, this is good. This has got so much cheese on it. Let me get one more here. Mm. There you go. I hope everybody got what they wanted for Christmas. I did. And um, what else I want to say? Oh, we had a joke sent in by one of our viewers, and it's kind of politically incorrect, but. I don't care. And um, we won't say the name of the person who sent it in. What would Kelly? Um, this guy he walks into a store and asks the employees where the kabaska is. And the employee asks him, kabaska is Polish meat. Sausage, I think. And, um, the lady replies saying, are you Polish? And he goes, yes. And then he asked her, um, he asked her, um, what does that have to do with it? Uh, do you have um, taco meat? And she goes, no. And he goes, you're not going to ask me if I'm Mexican? Uh, um, do you have um, um, taco meat, um, Italian sausage, would you ask me if I was Italian? And she's asking, she's answering no and no to all these questions. And he goes, um, wh why did you ask me if I was Polish and if we had the Polish meat? And she kind of turns and looks at him and says, this is Home Depot. This is Home Depot. Now I kind of screwed it up. But I'm good for screwing up uh, jokes like that. So this is, is the end and beginning of the new year. And we've been telling a lot of jokes lately. Most of them funny, some of them not. Uh, I'm going to say one of my most funniest ones. I really like this year is two cannibals are sitting around a campfire and they're eating they're eating a clown and one cannibal looks at the other one and says does this taste kind of funny to you okay enough jokes for the day that was a good joke Kelly and if I would have told it right I just kind of got scribbled here all over the place and I know I left out half the joke and it could have been funnier if you would have told it for us. Mm. Getting back to this salad. This salad is good. This salad has those red things on it. Get a little crunch. Oh, it's got our um, romaine glaze. Um, this is salad. Um, Compared to Wendy's, Wendy's had a couple other things though on theirs. It started apart taste-wise, but for value and then taste and all that good stuff, I think they got a winner there. And a one four, I'm going to give this a a a a a. One out of four. One out of five. Uh, I don't see anything wrong with the salad. Lots of everything. Flavors. Delicious. Meat. Um, 
Are you using with steak and shake steak meat? Uh, I'll get this again, I swear. Four bucks? Yes. Okay. Um, I'm going to give it a one to four. I'm going to give it a five. I don't know why I keep saying one to four. Five. Because this is really good. Something gets a five round here. You get one of these. Stuff didn't come out. There we go. La, 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 la. Crazy Tasty Food Review Show. Today, brought to you by Steak and Shake. And remember, it's fine. Because the show is almost over. Uh, I'd like to uh, say thank you, everybody, for um, you in this show. We'll have more shows next year, I hope. We've we got a couple things in mind. I say this a hundred times. Of course, changes in the show that usually never happen. But anyway, this is the way this show's going, and it's going to go. And I want to thank you all for listening, bearing with me, and I'll see you again on the next crazy, tasty food review show. Goodbye, everybody, and see you next time.